this is the only thing that flag is truly good for. To do anything less than that with this degenerate piece of shit, one is promoting, condoning, and encouraging this. No more in America. How much longer will you allow the banners to come in and burrito ties Florida? How much longer are you going to allow the Jew to continue to parasite himself off of your hard work, off of your energy, off of the things that you do? How much longer are we going to do this, ladies and gentlemen? The time has come that we have to stop. You must stand up for your race. You must stand up for your children. No one else will. You have hundreds of groups that stand in defense of all the mud races. How many groups stand in defense of the white race? We can't even get our own government to stand for the white race. No one is coming to save us. It is time that we save ourselves. It's time that we pick up every ounce of dignity and decency that we have and truly save the white race. Blood tribe must not be doing anything. You guys are all hanging out here. Yeah, it's the OBS effect. The OBS effect. <laughs> are you all affiliated with Blood Tribe? No. Mm -mm. no the or Order they of the do. Black Sun with affiliates from 14 First yeah, and uh, Aryan, Freedom Network. Aryan Freedom Network. Are you all affiliated with um, Menadeo? No. Hey. OBS is the ones running this state. Yeah. Order Black Sun runs Florida, not the GDL. Who runs Florida? We do. Order of the Black Sun, OBS. Sonic Guard? Sonic Red, yeah. Black Sun. Why the DeSantis flag? Because we support a lot of his policies. A lot of his policies are far right wing stuff. And he uh, says that blacks benefited from slavery, which we would definitely we did. completely agree with that. That's all they're good for, slavery. So you, so you agree with um, the, the statement that he made? Oh yeah, absolutely. Do you, um, what, that slavery was good for the black race? Fuck yeah. How was, was it not? <laughs> Seriously, ask yourself that. How was slavery not good for the black race? They want recompensation for being here and all of this other shit, but please tell me, wasn't the fact that they got to stay here compensation enough for slavery? When you stop and you look at the colors over in Africa right now, how are they living? What type of environment do they have? What type of civilization? Do you see them driving around in brand new cars? Do you see them living in actual houses? No, of course not. So the nigger being brought over here, forced to be a slave for 150 years, and then turning around and being granted free honorary membership as a citizen in this country, that was payment enough. They have it 10 times better than anybody in Africa as we speak. So at that point, yes, slavery was the greatest fucking thing to happen to these people. We've seen it. Where else do they do great? In other white countries that also had them as slaves in the beginning. Where do they do bad at? In the countries that they were born free? That should tell you something. Oh yeah, DeSantis is like, uh, niggers only believe in violence. That's the only reason that they do anything. Has, ha, the has DeSantis ever denounced you all? Like, has he ever denounced you guys? In no, public we're, I don't believe we're the, so. We're, the, we're, the, we're, the, we're, Ron Hol we're Ron's Holocaust task force. We're his biggest supporters. 
So like, are you prepared? Like, what would you do? How would you how would you respond to Ron DeSantis denouncing you guys? What would you say to that? He's lying. If it happened, lying. he's trying yeah. to secure the presidency. He'll say yeah, he's running he for president. He's he's got to fake it, fake it to make it, man. Well, as we all know, in order to be a politician in this country, you have to pander to the Jews. Very yeah. simple. Israel actually gives out a document to all new politicians on how to answer the Israel question and how to stand in support and solidarity with Israel. So Ron DeSantis currently is just doing smoke and mirrors with them to act as if he is truly a friend of the Jew, when in reality he is a friend of white America. And the prominent example, most prominent example, is his smoke and mirrors campaign of HB 269. HB 269, he signs in Israel. Think about that for a second, folks. You have an, an American, a United States governor, actually in Israel signing a bill that is going to govern the people of America. Not the people of Israel, the people of America. And of course, they instantly went off and said, oh, well, this is the greatest thing. This is going to stop X, Y, and Z. And then after it was said and done with, it didn't stop anything. The Jews have come to realize that Ron DeSantis isn't the guy they thought he was. He, they've come to understand that he is truly out for what is in the best interest of white America because he knows that white America is the only way America can still sustain itself and prosper. Civilization is white. You know that in Africa they have an uh, American colony, Liberia. And they basically duplicated the U.S. Constitution and they let it be run by black people. It's complete shithole. They don't understand how it works. They only understand hey, Cole, uh, you do realize he's going to beat your ass, right? Snicker liquor. You don't know what Cole is going to do. He's a snicker liquor. I've got to figure that. He can you that term in your university. Hey, are you saving money for when you're a single mom? You should. It's in your future, statistically. Did, did you guys like President Trump? No. Well, well, he's a pussy. He didn't do anything he said he was going to do. Yeah. And if you vote for him again and he gets in, he's not going to do anything. He married all of his kids off to Jews. Because he knows the system. Yeah. He knows the Jews have the power, so marry off your kids and keep that power. He's another yeah. politician. He fucking jerks you off until you vote for him, and then he doesn't do shit for you. Where are Ron DeSantis supporters? You like Ron DeSantis. Yeah, he actually does shit for us. Okay, can you explain it one more time why you like Ron DeSantis? I've already explained it like eight times. Yeah, yeah, like, if you were elected president, what would you like to see him do, policy-wise? Uh, you should shut down Disney World. It's run by kikes and pedophiles. I uh, got it. He should build a gigantic fire tornado generator and drop the communist in by parachute. Yep. Should make communism illegal. They, we're, he's going to no, build a gigantic... Homosexuality. Ron DeSantis is going to build a gigantic fire tornado generator and drop the communist in by parachute as a form of execution. Bring back the death penalty. <laughs> Right he should get rid of all the Jews. He's going to build holocausters Jews right here in Disney leave. World. We made the gleam no. Have you guys ever been allied with the other groups in, in Florida? Like, I, honestly, I'm just curious about like the rift or whatever. Well, there's really not a rift. They do what they do. Obviously, we do what we do. It's kind of like um, politics. Okay. Yes. Guys... Support anyone that's pro white. I'll yes, say that. exactly. There isn't a rift between one side or the other. There isn't a fracture within the white power movement. Those yeah, they're, they're is out trying to save our race. Not at all. There is no rift. They do their things, we do ours. Everybody has to do the way they see it. That way we can make the biggest impact and guarantee the survival and advancement of the white race. Every group has their own thing. Like what we do today, this is OBS, this is 14 First, AFN, we are all coming here together today. Whatever works for these other groups, as long as they're getting out the pro-white message, 
We're all, we're all there for it. Seriously though, look at I'll tell you yeah. what the difference is between a white nationalist and a Nazi, all right? Yeah. A white nationalist is somebody who wants an all white country but isn't willing to do any do what it takes to get it. A Nazi is somebody who wants an all white country and is willing to do what it takes to get it. God damn, this chicken says nigger better than you do. Oh, <laughs>